Boy, you know, bedtime battles, picky eaters. We have six kids between us, so we know being a parent can be pretty stressful. The anxiety can often spill over to your children, especially if you're a mom. Teresa Woodard explains how being stressed out during pregnancy can lead to a stressed out baby nine months later. Yes, she definitely has my spirit. <laughs> Elena might be one of the smiliest one year olds around, but it wasn't all that easy to get here. When I got pregnant, it was just, oh my goodness, it was like a tornado of feelings. And I just, I didn't understand why I was feeling that way or why I was having those thoughts. Larissa Clark had an anxiety ridden pregnancy. Therapy helped her work through it and pinpoint the cause. She was abused as a child. New research suggests the stress Larissa felt while carrying Elena might make Elena more prone to stress someday too. Cortisol in your body is a biomarker. It indicates when someone is feeling stress. Researchers from a Canadian university tracked cortisol levels in mothers-to-be from before conception through the first eight weeks of pregnancy. More than a decade later, the researchers measured cortisol in the women's 11-year-old children when those kids were facing stressful situations. And what they noticed was that the mothers who had high stress levels in the pregnancy, their children had high stress levels whenever they were having to do things such as speak in public. Larissa is still seeing a therapist at Parkland Hospital in Dallas who specializes in the mental health of mothers. It was a reality check. While it might sound surprising that stress at conception can lead to stressed out kids, Based on this licensed clinical social worker's career experience, the science makes sense. We all know that whenever you are stressed out, you're probably not your best. She tells women who are trying to get pregnant and then once they are pregnant, to be mindful that everything they experience, their baby experiences too. I need to be healthy mentally for my child so that way I can be that happy parent that I want to be to help her grow up because I'm her teacher. So. So I'm still in that process. <laughs> so that smiling, happy baby becomes a happy, healthy woman. In Dallas, I'm Teresa Woodard. And from stress during pregnancy to after, for the first time ever, there's now a drug made specifically for new moms suffering from postpartum depression. The FDA just approved the drug called Zulreso. The drug is delivered through an IV and works fast. According to doctors, it could improve symptoms within 24 hours. Well, it is.